Hey guys and welcome to another episode of Power of View Times and Micro Toys. Today we're going to be doing a review on the Transformers Kingdom War for Cybertron Trilogy RC. I've already got out of the box, so yeah. So what you get with RC is a card, is a sticker, and then bring in the stand. And I take my um little wish wish you get off. Also, you get a little gun. I don't say why have I got light on her, and um, yeah. So with my one, I kind of got is she's got issues here. So um, we'll take the backpack off because it is possible to do, and that's its own little piece. So articulation on RC is her head. <coughs> is on a ball joint her arms on a ball joint elbow no hand weight swivel swivel at the waist you can kick up that high and that far back beautiful spread knee joint slightly swivel there and foot but let's get her half transformed so, like I said, this does its own transformation when you have a stand on it. So you've got to kind of be so temperamental on doing that. So that's how you get her to stand on it. And there we go. Like so. So, and then she can hold her gun. Like so. But this is a um, kind of a, what do they call it, a shell former. So what you need to do is turn her head around, pull this whole section up, mind that out way, get your nail in there and get the wheels out, like so. Get the wheels all the way up, then get this part and grab this little clip here and push these in so it actually lines up I don't like this, this is the only part of this I don't like is there we go, so once that's lined up push it down so it links in with the rest of the body so you've got to line up with the literally her back right here and just push down as far as you can sometimes it's easy sometimes not so there's her body in the car mode so far next you want to bring her arms in make sure they are in and untab these parts and then rotate her legs and push them up like so trying to keep the body still and then on the instructions it says you've got to push these to the side and then Literally, I always do this though. I always do it from the like the bum. Like turn her around and do it this way because I always find out it's always better to do it this way when you line it all up. So once you lined it up and tabbed it in, everything should just slip into place fine. Should. I'm not saying it up. There you go. I'm not saying it will, but hang on. And the 
the gun can sit up here. And then we look can have a hole on the back of her car mode and there it is. There's her car mode. I personally don't like it, it's too literally you flip it upside down and it's her robot mode. So yeah. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this review of the Kingdom RC. Hit that like button and the comment section on this video and how that um, subscribe button and I'll catch you on the next one what are hopefully going to be some McFarlane toys figures and I'll catch you on the next one pal for now